Hello Planeswalkers, and welcome back to another Advent Commander, where I'm building a 100 card commander deck for Magic Sealed product. And today's pack is... Rivals of Ixalan. So let's get into the pack. First card is Sea Legs, then Frilled Death Spitter, Fanatical Firebrand, Hunt the Weak, Vampire Revenant, Knight of the Stampede, Squire's Devotion, Secrets of the Golden City, Overgrown Armasaur, Gruesome Fate, Stormfleet Swashbuckler, Atsakan Seer, Expel from Orozka, Tomb Robber, and a Basic Plains. All right, so um, again, since I have a basic land here, I'm going with uh, traditional draft rules, and we're not taking basic lands anymore. I'm just going to be able to add as many basic lands as I need to the deck. With that being said, there's a couple of options here. Uh, the Fanatical Firebrand can be decently useful, but not in this deck. This really belongs in a very fast aggro deck or some kind of goblin strategy. So it could be useful as a one drop, but not in this situation. Next is the Squire's Devotion, which gives a creature plus one plus one in lifelink and also gets me a one one token with lifelink, all for three mana. Useful, yes, and with the general I have in mind, could be very funny and make some difficult rules calls. But I don't think I'm going to go with this card. But the next card, Secrets of the Golden City. For one and two blue mana, I can draw two cards. And then if I have the City's Blessing, I can draw three cards. So if I have uh, ten or more permanents out, and I cast this spell, I get to ascend and gain the City's Favor. Or if I've gained the City's Favor earlier in the game... I get to keep it the entire game. So drawing three cards is really good, especially for three mana. So that's what we're taking. Secrets of the Golden City. Thanks for joining me, everybody. And I'll have another pack and another pick tomorrow. See you then.